Hello, crypto world. Welcome to The Chart Historian. My name is Justin, and on this channel, I delve deep into crypto charts, exploring chart structures, fractals, and patterns. So today I have the XRP chart open, and I'd like to give a quick little update on what is currently taking place. So if you've been following my previous XRP videos, you know that XRP is currently working through the capitulation fractal or the capitulation phase of the overall decline. So the ca original capitulation fractal looks something similar to this. Now, every time it plays out, it plays out a little differently. This took place back in 2013, which was the original one that ever took place. Essentially, everything after 2013, when it comes to a capitulation fractal after a bear market is a copy of this fractal. As you can see, it's different, but it has a good resemblance to this original one. This is not what I actually want to show you. So what I want to show you is this fractal right here. Now, where did I get this fractal from? So if you take this little area right here and copy and paste it, now I stretched it out to meet this time structure versus this smaller time frame. So it's, it's, it's a little larger. But as you can see, it is actually playing out pretty well. They both move up here. They both move down here. They move back up here, comes crashing back down here, moves up to a little peak, comes crashing down, makes a higher peak right here. And now it has come down and it's moving just basically flat and sideways. Actually, if you zoom in onto an hour chart, you can get a better look at it. And you can see that it's actually following fairly closely. So... If this continues to follow this pattern or this fractal, we should expect to see something similar to this. Now, every time it plays out, it will be unique. So there could be some variance to this original one right here. But the overall structure could be something similar to this. And in so doing, it would actually accomplish the same thing that this one play does in that it's bringing XRP down to a capitulation point. Now, I don't know exactly where that capitulation point will be. We'll find out as time moves on. There is another interesting thing that I want to show you. And if you take, if you compare this fractal right here that we have on the screen to Bitcoin, you'll see that it's actually quite similar. So let's compare to Bitcoin. So I have Bitcoin here on the lower frame. And let me put a vertical line so you can see how they both kind of move in sync. So price moves up. Let's show the movement a little better here on the Bitcoin chart. So price moves up, moves back down. You can see that they're they both move up together, they both move down together, they both move up together, they both move down together. This is very, very normal for XRP to follow Bitcoin in this manner. But the interesting thing here is that this fractal here could actually be an indicator of what we should expect with Bitcoin to a certain degree. So right now they're both going flat we could see something where Bitcoin does something similar to this. It goes up, pulls back down. Now, I am of the belief, I used to believe that XRP, I mean, sorry, Bitcoin was just doing a quick little retracement and gonna move to a new low, but now I believe we are currently working on wave three, which is the final wave before the capitulation. So if that is the case, then I would expect Bitcoin to stay above its current lows so it would not go below this low here. It would, it, If it moved down, it would stay above this low. And then I actually believe that it's going to move up to a point higher than here. But this is not a Bitcoin video. So let's stay on, on track here and focus on XRP. So as you can see, this fractal is a good indicator of potentially what Bitcoin can do. That was the point of showing, of comparing Bitcoin to XRP and this fractal. So in conclusion, XRP is currently working out its capitulation phase of the overall bear market or declining structure that XRP has been in for the past while. 
at some point it's going to come to a capitulation point and then it'll XRP will move on into a new phase in the XRP chart. It will be a sideways range bound time before moving on into its next bull run. This fractal right here may be the mechanism that brings it down to that capitulation point. And this fractal could be an indication of what Bitcoin might do. Well, I hope this video was helpful. If you did find it helpful, it'd be appreciated if you hit that thumbs up button. If you enjoy videos like this where I analyze fractals and chart structures and patterns, please hit that subscribe button because you'll be updated whenever I put out new videos, which is on a regular basis. One important thing, I'm not a financial advisor, so nothing I present here should be construed as investment or financial advice. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you catch my next one. Have a great day and bye for now.